How about the fact that our media cannot exist unless they're making people panic about something? This is another thing that struck me while I was off. They have no reason to exist. You know why? Because they're competing now with Honey Boo Boo and Sexy Vampires. <laughs> you know, in the old days, they didn't have to make a profit. Now they do. And they, unless they're making you panic, they got nothing. Unless it's the fiscal cliff or the Mayans or the flu. The flu. I got the flu one day. Okay? What? And when I broke down and took the Tylenol, I didn't feel anything. It's it, you're gonna die. Everyone's gonna die. You know who dies when the, the flu's going around? Old people. <laughs> it's nature's way of killing old people who are gonna die anyway. Right. But I think also this is a country that is the most entertained and the less informed. And it's scary yes. that an average system, an average citizen is not as informed as any oh, other yeah. citizen in the world. And it's That's really scary right. because and they Because try... we're the superpower. That's why it's scary. It wouldn't yes. be that scary if we didn't have any power. Yes, yeah, but and also know, because you have buttons and you can push and you can blow up somebody Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but it's else. also focus. It's very hard to be focused uh, right now in this country because you have 87 different things interrupting you. When I was a, a, a little boy watching television, I had to cross the room to switch to the other six options. Boy, you're old. Yeah. No, this was, uh, this is like, I, this is Herbert Hoover's time. No, this is, uh, no, you this is... Yeah, I did too. Yes. Yeah. Um, and, and so therefore you watched a black and white, you know, uh, King Kong where you...